Greetings and salutations, my fellow Entropians. All right, we're finally at the Orthos oil field. All right, we're not under it or swimming around under it at all. We're finally here. So we, I can finally make the video I wanted to make last night. Yeah, all right, let's put our big money in just in case we get something good, okay? All right, so this is going to be a mining run. Why is it going to be a mining run, guys? Um, well, uh... I found that if you mine in a PvP area, any PvP area probably, um, you're going to be able to get some pretty decent and nice stuff. Um, pyrite actually drops here. It is very rare, but it drops here. So maybe maybe we might be able to get some now. I've been I've been going up against my biggest rule where everything I do in this game I have to have it recorded. I stopped doing that. Just so I could like have some chill time and relax time and just do my own thing. And yeah, I, I've been running out of universal ammo. But we've been getting some good returns. Like the last time I like checked my mining roster, my mining materials and stuff like that. It was well over 200 PED. And that's fantastic. It really is. Let's see. Let's go, go ahead and make our first drop right here. I just want to go ahead and say that this little area right here is pretty good for mining now i found that if you're the only person here your loot returns seem to be a lot better so if that's any indication of like maybe you should probably start killing people uh so you can remain to be the only person here <laughs> it might be an interesting idea um i i decided it would be kind of funny um i'm sorry to whoever it was but they were they were like riding in one of their little go-karts and stuff right through the area and i decided well hey it's a pvp area let's blow them up and i did and then his friend stopped like right outside the area like oh man he just blew up my friend so he starts shooting at me with a rocket launcher and i'm like it took it, it gave me no damage and I, I just come in here with no armor on but it, it really did, like, no damage to me. So I ended up, like, murdering him as well. And then I dropped a probe. And whenever I dropped a probe, it was, like, an ample. So maybe, like, getting some kills and stuff in this PvP area is kind of nice. and Because it might affect your loot in some ways. It's weird. We don't know how this game works. Because they keep it secret and stuff. And it's probably a good idea. But... I just wanted to share that little tidbit with you in case you want to come here and have a little bit of fun. Now, I do know that you know it's probably a little bit unfair for me to go around just randomly slaying the new players that come here because this is right right outside of Icarus, but I mean it it, it is what it is. It it's it's sometimes fun. It looks like we have only gotten like what a little bit of copper just just a tiny bit. And maybe some some of this stuff too. The Al Alice. My reading comprehension is horrible today. <coughs> but yeah, I, I like I like coming here to mine every once in a while. And I'm a low level miner. Like I'm pretty low to the point where you know I'm probably right alongside everyone else that's in Camp Icarus. <laughs> The truth be told, maybe a little bit higher, but like, yeah, I'm still just a starting out miner. So mining in this area just seems like it, it seems fun to me. But as you can see, we are getting some decent drops, like size wise and whatnot. So maybe it is kind of worth it to come here. Of course, the little robots that you get to fight here, well, they they're the ones that drop the weapons, like these things, these uh, Solomate Rubios. They drop kind of. I found a lot more frequent than I would like. Um, I don't really have time to sit there and sell those things, but I know that to the person that actually has a lot of patience and in the trading categories and stuff, yeah, I know. I sit here all the time, like, yo, be it, like, start trading, guys. Like, trading's important, and I don't even do it. And whenever I do do it, it's on the auction house and stuff like that. So it is what it is. All right. I'm taking antibiotics for these kidney stones. Uh, I guess some sort of 
infection or something. So, yeah, I just started taking those. And I've been sleeping all day. I've been drinking lots of water. It's just been, uh, just, I think there's a battle raging inside my body right now. And, uh, I've I just been feeling so sleepy lately. Of course, I should probably go after some more long tooths, but here, here's the thing. I'm, I'm, I'm on a decline this month with Entropia uh, for putting money in, mostly because, well, I, I, there's other investments I want to make. Um, I want to throw some money into the stock market or something. Like I use a, a thing called Stash, and apparently you, you get to put any amount of money you want and anything and they calculate it and all that stuff um it's actually pretty cool i like using it um but it's it's always good to diversify i suppose and then maybe here in in a while we'll i mean it's not like i'm not getting money in this game every day like today was another single pay day and 1060 1060 yeah i mean I, we just keep getting money in this game so might as well just keep it and keep keep going like every day log in see how much i get so i mean i i have a good operating budget for videos i i believe like 10 pd is pretty good like no lie like if i mean 10 pd a day like it, it's enough to it, in this area right here to have a little bit of fun, honestly, um, because every, it's cheap. And if you play cheap, you can you can play for a while. So that's an important little facet to understand. Now my loot has been really really bad. I, I think I've already cleaned this whole area out, honestly, um, or maybe it's just. I'm not up in the, uh, hey, let's give Lore Spade some money today because he hasn't deposited in a, in a quick minute. That makes me sad, Mind Art. But then again, maybe I'm just building up to something big, which is going to be fantastic. But yeah, I love this little area, but I, I'm not lo loving these loot returns right now. Looks like we have gone full circle. I love this little hill right here. It kind of kind of gives me a little bit of a idea uh, that, well... I, li I like landing on it whenever I'm flying by. Look, looks like we got some more copper stone. Got to run all the way back and get it. And yeah, let's just let's just be real. No, I haven't seen anybody. But if we see somebody, we're going to we're we're going to take them out. I know. I don't. I, I, it's probably you watching right now. And yes, we're 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 premeditating right now that if we see anyone. It's going to be murder. But then again, I don't think anyone else is here right now. I mean, well, it's like 1.21 a.m. in the uh, east coast of America. So it's, I don't, I don't know if people, it's Friday night, all right? So people are probably not up in it to win it tonight. They're probably out and about having fun. IRL. So jealous. So jealous. Wow. But speaking of which, yeah, I, I'm actually really jealous of, like, previous loot returns. I think they know. Every time I start streaming, they're like, nope, nope, cut him off, cut him off. We, we, don't, we don't need him showing the world that you can make money in this game. Which, honestly, you know, I, I've said it before. Doing stuff like this, it's, it's for fun. It's strictly for fun. If you're going to hunt mine and stuff like that you do it for fun don't do it to try to make money because uh, you, you won't you might but odds are you won't so keep that in mind whenever you're playing like the ways you make money is you you invest in properties and you invest in items and you sell those items for more money that's how you do it that, that's 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 how, how it all works and stuff like this i mean trying to break even is is uh is very hard and trying to make money is very hard. It's not impossible, though. It's not impossible, but we all know it's very hard. So keep that in mind when you're coming into this game. A new shirt. Give me liberty. Oh, yeah. 
With that being said, I think, uh, wow, I, we, we, we got absolutely nothing. Maybe we should go, like, right into the middle of everything. We'll see how this works. Just keep keep going and, and maybe, maybe, because we've, like, skirted all the outside, leaving the inside core alone. And that's probably where all the loot is now, by the, all the robots. And we might have to kill some of those. All right, we're, we're, I'm, I at least want like something like five PD, I want five PD worth of something. All right, it looks like we are right in the middle of the robots. They're not going to hurt me too much. They might, yeah, they're going to start shooting at me. Searching, searching, no resources found. All right, we're gonna we're gonna do Captain Overkill. Ooh, you got hurt, sir. Oh, missed. I'm, I'm still still in the learning period for hit for this big gigantic new brand new attack chip there you go a solo mate Rubio right there that's probably gonna land somebody some money I, I'm probably just gonna give it away that's right I'm gonna give it away and of course you get crude oil drops from fighting these guys which is kind of cool and because I, I think because I'm actually overkilling these guys the loot table is you to where I'm going to be getting some extra stuff. I don't know if that happens for everyone, but I mean, if you're going to one-shot kill these things, you better get something good. Um, because they changed the mechanic to where uh, it's it's how much you put into a mob is what you get out of it, instead of uh, just no looters and all that stuff. So it's interesting that they changed that to that way. As you can see, we're getting, getting at least a little bit of return for what we're putting in. I don't know why they changed it, but I like the way they did that. So that's that's pretty good. Looks like oh jeez. Stop walking! I'm trying to hit you. Okay, there we go. Now it looks like we were like right up in the thick of things, right up in the middle. So we're gonna see if we can't get a good good mining drop after we clear out just a few more robots. All right, here we go. Anything good? Now, apparently, back in the day, like oil used to drop in this little area, but not anymore because all the Ubers would come here and uh, just beat up everybody, and so they got rid of it, which I'm okay with, in a way. It, it would be interesting if they could like change that to where it only drops for people under a certain level, and only they can see it. That would be interesting. Um, I don't know how to code or anything like that, so, I mean, I, I can't do that for them, but that would just be an interesting idea for them to adopt. I don't know. I don't make the rules or anything like that, but it is what it is. Wow, no resources. This has been the worst. Like, why? Why? I'm, I'm trying to show off here and try to get something good, and there's nothing here. There's no resources found anywhere. I'm sad. But, I mean, to be fair, I mean, last time we came here, we was, we was swimming under the ground. That's fine. That's, 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 that's fine, I guess. It's just, whatever. Let's just kill robots. That's, that's what it wants us to do. Now, that, that, okay, loot theory time. Like, sometimes I think, like, whenever you log in, is the game will reward you if you do a certain uh, a certain path, like a hunt or a mining or crafting. It rewards you a little bit better, like depending on what the algorithm says whenever you log in. I don't know. It, it seems like some sort of conspiracy theory, but you never know with this game. It's weird like that. Jeez, oh, Pete's. Better give me a lot of money. Yeah, there you go. Six, 65 cents. <laughs> Um, one thing I really do love about these chips is the DK on them is not that horrible. 250 right there. Oh yeah. Okay, may maybe maybe we should have been hunting this entire time. Hunting these ro oh jeez, hunting these robots would probably be a good idea. All right, guys, we're gonna we're gonna take out a few couple more of these. Uh, it doesn't look like we're gonna get anything good today, but I mean to be fair, we were kind of over leveled. In, in in the the low level zone being cheap <laughs> and uh maybe maybe i get penalized but you know what because of all my losses here 
Um, I don't, I don't know if it works like this, but maybe I've just put money into the ground here. So maybe if you come here on, on your own time and, you know, maybe, maybe you might get a little bit of that money I put into the ground for you. I mean, why not, right? I mean, if that's how it works, then you, you should probably come here and see, see if you can't get my money. You know, win, win Laura Spade's money. Wait, we got something. We we found something. We actually found something. We don't know what it is. Let's see what it is. It's unknown. All right, here we go. Platinum stone. What? I'm telling you, there is all sorts of stuff here. That's one platinum stone right there, and uh, it it's probably mostly used for spaceships or something. I don't know. But yeah, you can get all sorts of goodies here. I I'd really be surprised if you can actually start getting gold here. I don't know. Like it just seems like I've had a wild amount of different ores that I found here to include pyrite too cuz that's a PVP zone exclusive. So I mean this might be a really good place to mine. Of course, it's not lootable PVP, so I mean you can always keep your stuff. I mean, keep just be careful, regardless, because it is kind of kind of a little walk to get here. Or you know, you can always just get in your vehicle and uh, go. All right, guys, let's see. I'm just gonna hop in this this bad boy. We're gonna start heading back to right there. If you if if you can get your graphics to to where you can see this thing right here that that is actually camp Icarus right there that, that big tree I, I know this because I, I'm really weird like that all right guys thank you for watching thank you for listening thank you for liking commenting and subscribing subscribing comment down below well I mean co comment something like uh, I don't like mining here because I never get anything. Or I like mining here because I always get something. Or make a comment to where you just be happy. I don't know. Whatever you want to say. Where are we going now? I don't think we're going the right way anymore. Alright, let's see. Uh, I guess that's the end of the video, guys. Bye. Buttons.